Here would be my final question, and I'll just drop it, and then you could decide if we ever talk again. Um, <laughs> if your theology is based on sanctif com sanctification comes through simplicity, poverty, and suffering, could it not be that as a church gets bigger and more complicated, it's hard mm -hmm. to keep it simple, um, mm -hmm. as you become more successful and there's more money and real estate and book sales, um, it becomes harder um, and mm -hmm. suffering if you're not healthy, you didn't, you don't have to waste your cancer because you didn't get cancer. Um, you know, you're healthy, your wife loves you, your kids are okay. It seems to me like if, if the primary view of sanctification comes through simplicity, suffering, poverty, if you don't get those things, it's almost like when God blesses, mm -hmm. it's hard to be sanctified because you don't know what to do with them. Mm -hmm. And so you almost have to get rid of that which is complicated, make life hurt a little more, go to a third world country, mm -hmm. Um, mm -hmm. or and or adopt poverty and give it all away because you're only allowing God to sanctify you in the preconceived ways. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. No, I see what you're saying. You know, what if God wants to sanctify you through not poverty, but generosity, not mm -hmm. suffering, but, you know, blessing? And what if it's not through simplicity, but complexity? Yeah. And that's part of a sanctifying process. Yeah. So does that make sense? It does. I, I, I think that's a huge issue right now. I, I think it's a huge issue in the church, and I think it's, yeah. it's something we have to think through. Because in the reform world, you grow through suffering. But what if it's a good season? Yeah. Do you have to find a way to suffer? No, I don't, I I don't mean, believe it's that. I mean, it's, the reason this is so important, I think, is because, first of all, this is a materialistic, wealthy Christian world in mm -hmm. America. So we need to call people away from that. But at the same time, uh, that can... There can be so much passion and energy of, oh, this is, this is Christianity. Be a poverty this is poverty theology, yeah. Yeah. which is the same error as prosperity theology. That holiness it's comes not, from have not, or have not, not, the not who is. is. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, the issue has to be, to me, the, the core issue has to be love. Um, I, I think that was the understanding for in 2 Corinthians when he says, look, you guys are doing okay, and here are some people, your brothers, who are struggling here in Jerusalem. So. Mm -hmm. Let's, let's have some equality here. But again, the issue has to be love. I love these people. I want to help them. So I think in times of prosperity, for me, I look at Scripture and go, wow, this is awesome. Look at this. I had this great selling book. I had all this money. You know, <laughs> what do I want to do? I want to give it to the people who need it. Like, I, I get mm -hmm. excited about that. I also look and I, I go, wow, I get excited about becoming a picture of Christ. Mm -hmm who, of course, I have the right to, to sit here and get the stuff that I want and enjoy it. Um, but it's, again, letting go of that, not holding on to that and saying, you know what, his example was let me lay that down and, uh, and, and go and lay down my life for the brothers. And now, I agree, it, it, it's, it can become this, this uh, gosh, I'm going to pursue poverty because I think that's the way to sanctify Or suffering or simplicity. Yeah, rather than I'm going to pursue love of, mm -hmm. gosh, here's all these people that are dying that are in need. I mean, and I, when I met them, that's when I fell in love with them, and it actually was a joy to give. It's not like, oh, I think mm -hmm. I'm too rich and God's going to get mad at me. It's more... Gosh, even before, before I was rich, <laughs> um, I remember my wife would say, man, I love how we're living. Um, no complaints, you know, just mm. simplicity, whatever. Um, the one thing I just wish, I also want to be generous. Uh, and I go, yeah, honey, that just will never be us, you know, because that's for someone else. Yeah, right. And so for God to bless us now, we're so just, can't be I mean, we're in tears. Like, God, are you kidding me? You're going to let us live simply and be generous, mm -hmm. like, it's it's overwhelming. I mean, this is this is not like this, oh, France is such a martyr, he gives everything up. It's like, I'm going, this is a dream come true. I can just write, what, you need a hospital? Uh, let me write you a check for 